welcome back to my channel. I'm Katerina or Kat if you're new here and this is my channel of everything cozy bookish and lifestyle related and in today's video we are kind of just doing a November reset. We're resetting for the new month and I want to talk about my goals. It is insane. We are two months away from 2023 being done and 2024 starting and I my brain just can't really capture that right now. I can't believe how fast this year is gone. We need to slow down a little bit. We need to kind of take a little bit of time to reevaluate and rethink and, you know, take that time to kind of be in the moment, do things that I really enjoy on top of, you know, getting ready for the winter season. We did have our first snowfall and it was absolutely insane. It was also very beautiful. I mean, granted, I'm not a big fan of winter time. It was definitely an indicator of a transition from fall to winter. Now we're in winter. And so my focus for November is definitely a lot of self-care, making sure I'm taking care of myself during this winter season. So let's quickly talk about the goals that I have set for the month of November. So my first goal is a business goal, and that is reaching 500 subscribers. Now, getting a certain number of subscribers might be a goal that is out of my control because I can't force somebody to subscribe to my channel or not, but it is a goal of mine. I would absolutely love to reach 500 subscribers. It's definitely a dream to grow this channel. And then the other business goal is creating better thumbnails. Now, while I do enjoy the thumbnails that I am creating, I really do want to create more concise thumbnails as well as thumbnails that call out to me, as well as that I think will call out to other people. So those are the two business goals that I have for the month of November. And then for personal goals, the first personal goal that I have is to complete the TBR that I created with the TBR jar challenge. So if you haven't checked that video out, definitely go check it out. I use the TBR jar to help me pick out the books that I would read for the month of November. There were six books that I picked for the month of November, so I definitely want to at least try to get through all six of those books. Then my second personal goal is a book buying ban. So granted, book buying bans aren't that difficult for me, but I do tend to buy books because there's so many book releases in November. November is a massive book release month, especially for fantasy books and I tend to buy them all. So I'm kind of putting myself on a book buying ban and trying to wait until after the holidays to buy any books. And then the third and final goal under personal goals is journaling more often. So this is something that I love to do. Journaling is one of my favorite self-care activities to do. And I used to journal at least once or twice a week. However, in the last three to four months, I have noticed that I may be journaling two or three times a month. Most for November is to sit down and journal a little bit more often. So yeah, so those are my goals for November. I try not to set too many goals for myself in a month just because of the fact that I don't want to overwhelm myself. So with that, I need to do some cleaning. I want to do some reading. I do need to kind of plan out my month. So we're going to do that. Thank you. 
of the video guys here, but I quickly wanted to talk about how I go about my monthly planning because I do my monthly planning two different ways. I do it obviously as you saw through an actual physical planner, but I also do it through digital planning so that I always have my planner with me on the go and kind of knowing what is next at all times. But with the physical planner, I'm kind of able to just physically lay out everything that's going on and if it changes it changes but I just like being able to physically write things down and check them off. I do plan out my videos for the entire month. A lot of the time it does change. Videos maybe get moved around or maybe I don't have time for a very specific video. I do know that there's some times where there's bigger videos that I want to plan but it's hard to do it when I do have I try to post weekly so that might change here soon. I do enjoy posting weekly but there are some videos that I want to do that take a little bit more time and they would mean I would have to work on them a little bit longer. So here I also wrote down all of my most anticipated releases for the month of November, although at the beginning of this vlog I did talk about going on a book buying ban. And then I also like to list out my TBR for the month on my physical planner as well, just so I kind of have a reference. So that's kind of just like a, a lowdown of my planner and how I plan things out. So yeah, so also I really wanna quickly talk about my current read. I'm currently reading Bad Blood by Jennifer Lynn Barnes. This is the fourth and final book in the Naturals series. And guys, if I haven't said it once, I'm gonna say it a hundred more times. I highly recommend the series for people that love young adult literature, that love fast paced literature. It is insanely addictive. I can never put it down. As I said a hundred times, I was so surprised by the series, did not think I would like it. So yeah, so there you have it guys. That is my November reset video. I know it was a little bit all over the place. Let me know if there's anything you want to specifically see in my next reset video. Also make sure to like this video, give it a like guys, and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!